Hi everyone, new video for you today, and as you can see, it is an unboxing video. This is the May Plan Society box. Yes, it is a bit late as we are nearly at the end of June, but when I subscribed at the beginning of June, uh, we had the option to buy a previous kit, which was the May kit as well. So the May kit is here, the June kit is in the UK. When it will get here, hopefully in the next few days. So you may have two unboxings this week. So keep an eye out for that. If it will be, it will be up on Friday. Or you might have an extra video at some point in the week. So this is the May kit. And oh my god. I've got so many ideas for this kit. So when I was given the option to purchase the May kit, I snapped it straight up. So let's have a little look these this is the bag which i will be using as a layering because it is beautiful so the first thing i have here is this pencil case which is really really sweet again this is really really soft plastic if anyone see my haul video Plan Society haul video a couple of videos ago. I'll link it below if I remember. Um, there was a sticker book with the same material. And from what I've heard and what I've seen in some other unboxings, that all the planners are made with this same material. So I'm definitely thinking I'm going to be trying to get my hands on one of these TNs because this, these are so soft. So you have a little bow here and then a cool zip. And it just opens like that. I don't really have any cool pencil cases. So whenever I go to meetups or anything like that, I'm just bundling pens together with tape um, and put them in my bag. So this will definitely come in handy. Or if I'm planning downstairs, um, I film some videos downstairs sometimes if it is just too hot up here. Because obviously my craft room is upstairs where I live. Um, I, I can take my pens downstairs. So this is the first thing that was in there. Next we have these, which I believe are a new thing um, to the kit. Um, and these are like some decorative flowers. I can't get them out. Can you tell how excited I am? I can't open anything up. So what I love as well, they all have some really beautiful backing cards. But you have these flowers, which are like a, like a felt material. Um, so we have the pink beige and some green and then the little gems for the middle people have been using these in like dashboards and stuff i think i'm going to be using these in scrapbooking um because i can I, I can see myself like layering these up with some 3d foam or some tacky glue and making a little flower arrangement on a layout so that's what i'll be using these for next we have these these are the post-its well they're page flags um there's normally post-it notes but there's page flags this month and they come in this really cool little holder which you can just slip into your planners and then they all come out like that which i think is really cool and then there's some really beautiful designs again i'll probably use these in my planner for like forward planning but also i'll be using these probably in scrapbooking as well next we have the pen and i've used a few of the plan society pens and they're really good i'm just gonna just grab this little notebook i have here so it has like little cacti and some florals on and this beautiful kind of rose gold detail there's no clip on it which i kind of like because it will just slip into a um, pen holder uh it's got a little bit on the end So it's like, it's almost like a ballpoint pen, but it it kind of is really, really smooth as well. So I really like that. There's also some stickers. So I like that they're packaged separately. So they're in this really cool bag again, which will be um, used for layering. And these are the stickers. So we have some cool word stickers here, um, hashtag best day ever, planner love, planner date night, 
she believes she could so she did some really cool quotes and stuff on there so this would be good for either scrapbooking or planning i have started using quotes and like word stickers in my planner um so i'm really liking those there's this one which you have some habit trackers tiny little bits here so these could be dates or days of the week in my bullet journal we then have some decorative stickers uh, my mum and my dad and my brother are all on holiday my mum and dad are on a separate holiday and my brother has gone to turkey so he's going to be taking a lot of photos so these photos will come in handy for me scrapbooking his holiday because i can't go on these ones these really cool um these really cool birds and uh and little plants and stuff and then we have some more decorative ones i really like this one here i wish i had a little setup like that it's really pretty uh i love that chair and then there's some planners in here and some more decorative ones as well so that's the stickers for the month next there are some stamps so i think this one is supposed to be like they're supposed to be like habit trackers but um, I don't really track habits, um, so these will probably be just used in scrapbooking. It's always good to have some extra stamps. I'm still going. So then there's a washi tape, which I'm going to attempt to get into. So again, I'm going to bring over my little pad that I tried the pen on, just so I can roll this tape out. It looks absolutely gorgeous. Oh, it's very smooth as well. And we'll just have a look there's some um leaves and some florals and stuff on there so that's really cool there's then these paper clips which look so pretty so there's these kind of foam ones they're made of like a felt they feel really secure like the paper clip on the actual flower so that's always good and they're just really pretty. I really like those. The backing card's beautiful as well. Again, all these will be put into layering for um, scrapbooking and stuff. But there's those. I can't believe I'm still going. There's then these, which is one of the main reasons I wanted this kit. And these are pockets. So obviously there's the backing card. And people have been using these in their planners. So you put like a little bit of adhesive or stickers. Um, a little bit of adhesive on the back. And then use these to put stuff in your planner. But there's these beautiful lace designs. And the reason why I really wanted these, one, because they're beautiful, but two, me, myself and my husband have a wedding to go to um, in the second week of August, which is obviously the week after our anniversary. And the couple are doing, I think, what most couples are doing at most weddings and asking for donations towards something i can't remember um so it's like asking for money or vouchers so obviously i wanted a pretty way of just so just sticking money in a card so i thought these would be a really cool way of giving them a donation for their wedding i'm thinking more this one which is really really pretty there's like an almost sheen to the card if you can pick that up and i was just thinking of making a little tag or something just to slide in the little pocket here and then have the money or the or the gift card on the back um and just kind of design a card a, a, a gift tag myself with their names and their wedding date and all that kind of stuff something a little bit more personalized and i just think that's a really cool little wedding gift um, obviously you can use these for what they were meant for which is pockets in your planner but i'm really just thinking these are really cool um like birthday cards or little presents so that's what i'm using those for there's then these which are some doilies um i've run out of doilies actually the only ones i've got are some uh, ones that i got from the pound store which is which are not great to be honest but i see these in an unboxing and they're just so delicate so again we have a really cool backing card and then we have three of the larger ones which are beautiful and then these oh my god that that print is beautiful and then we have three they're so delicate as well i'm probably going to haul these but these will eventually hopefully make their way onto a scrapbook layout then we have the tabs and the ephemera so i will show you the tabs first so we have a little backing card there these are the words so we have um two sheets of those and two sheets of 
those. I really like the font. And then I'll just quickly go through the tags. So some beautiful, beautiful tags there. So if you're setting up your month, I'm probably gonna be using these to set up my TN. And you have just, I love that print there. So beautiful. And then we have the ephemera. We just have some journaling cards first. So there's this one that has uh, make someone's day brighter today. Beautiful minds inspire others. Choose to be happy, one of a kind. Make the world a prettier place. So they're always in with the ephemera. Now let's look at these. And then we have the papers. I can't believe how much are in these kits. Two sheets of this one, and this is the reverse print, which is the print from the bag. There are two sheets of this one, which I'm going to be hoarding because that is just stunning. And then the reverse is like the palm leaves. Oh my goodness, that is so pretty. And then there's two sheets of this one, which is little cactuses. And then we have that floor that is the washi tote floor on the reverse. So they are the normal papers. We then have the specialty papers. So there's this vellum that's got like the little um, plant pots on. There's then this one, which is that floral again, which is absolutely stunning. And then there's a vellum, which I don't know if we're gonna be able to see this. Bring out the book again, and you can see that there's some floral flamingos. So that was everything that was in this kit. I can't quite believe how much is in here. I cannot wait for my June kit to come. As soon as that comes, I will unbox it for you. So keep an eye out for that. But thank you so much for watching, and I'll speak to you all in my next video. Bye.